What's up, everyone? Let's get started. Jig hook size 14, copper bead, 3.5 millimeter, tungsten, orange thread. The tail is orange yarn. For the ribbing, we're going to be adding two materials. One is just your like 4X tippet size mono. And then we've got some Malar tinsel. For the body, we're going to be using as an SLF prism hair's ear. Create a dubbing noodle, dubbing thread. Okay, once we get the dubbing, come back to the tail. And then touching turns all the way up to the bead. Now we're gonna go opposite direction that we're tying the thread with the Millar tinsel and bring that and wrap that through the body a few times. And then secure it at the bead. We're gonna wrap that mono the opposite way, securing that tinsel. We are now going to use Brahma Hind dyed March Brown, tied point of the feather in first. There we go. Get our hackle pliers. And then as you come in, bring the feathers back. As you begin to wrap, not come in. As you begin to wrap, bring those feathers back. And then secure. that feather. There we go. At this point, the fly can be done. You can create an orange collar with a few whip finishes and it'll still fish well. Or you can add a collar as well. Maybe peacock. This one I like to add a little bit of peacock. There we go. And then a couple whip finishes.
and you're good to go. There's the finishing fly. It's begun on the Provo right now for me. If you enjoy the videos, please consider subscribing. It helps the channel. As always, cheers to tight lines. What's up everyone? Andrew here with Family Fly Ties. Currently seeking to bring another video here on the middle Provo. Uh, hoping to get into some browns, some rainbows, and maybe some whitefish. But as always, cheers to tight lines. Oh, that's a nice white fish. Yep, go ahead. There you go. Nice. On another one. What I'm talking about. Oh, yeah. Ah, right when is it a whitey? Feels like a whitey. But it's a brown. Nice. Oh. oh, that's a nice brown too. Well, I can't complain. Two browns today and a white fish thus far. Right there. Good fish. But I don't want to touch him. It looks like he got hammered at one point. So... Let's just do a release. There we go. And there he goes. If we don't get any hits here, then I will be switching up my flies to something else. Um, got one. Nice. And what is he on? Fish. Good fish, guys. Right there. I don't want to touch him, I've got gloves on. But uh, hopefully you guys can see him, not a bad fish. So we'll just put him back in and let him go. Oh nice, that was a fish. <laughs> that was such a soft hit, I wasn't sure. But, uh, Again, I don't want to touch him, so I'm just gonna... Come on. There you go. 